House of Dance was a, basically a commission from the New York City Players, and it came about in part because they have a really good relationship with Abrams Art Center where we are and we're interested in trying to do it in a space here and there are some theater spaces here but I'd actually been interested in this kind of jankety downstairs room that we're in right now um, because it had these awesome mirrors and something about it always looked like a down low tap dance studio to me. Some instinct I had towards tap over ballet or any other kind of dance. And it also seemed like since I knew we weren't going to go out and find tap dancers necessarily to be in it, and I know it's not like, oh, anyone can just tap, that it's a very, very specific and awesome and like this really cool history and really hard art form, but it seemed like we could kind of maybe make some elements of it work so that it looked like we had, I was, and it, these performers, so they're not tappers, but we could learn enough that they could do the setups of like being a student, being a teacher who didn't tap the whole time, doing some cool steps and dances that were evocative of it. It's written as like a true kind of realistic tap dance class that starts. So it has these moments where they start teaching or they work on a routine. So it already was kind of all in there. We've since added a bit more like showy numbers here and there that um, break out of that mold of like just being in the classroom because we realized that there was cool stuff we could do with tap. So I think in these last like, couple weeks leading up to the opening, where that's what we'll be actually refining now is how those tap numbers do work in with the other stuff.